Hello, so as you can see this is the first hotfix, now there is a little bit of a story behind all of this and let's just go over it for now, let's just say that the first hotfix came a little later than expected and I read somewhere on the steam forums that the first expansion was supposed to contain a lot of quality of life stuff and a lot of other mechanic fixes and all the, I don't know, it was supposed to contain a lot more content that the developers want to release as an expansion you actually had to buy but because of the negative well, basically because of the backlash, the negative responses, the reviews and the general no from the gamers and the fans and even from the broad audience, I guess the developers decided, well, there's a big difference over here, the studio and the investors probably decided against the patch being released now because this is not a big patch this is not the patch that is supposed to have difficulty settings and a lot of other things though no no this is just a hard fix so there's something very weird happening with the game right now because they have a lot of new fixes patch a lot of fixes a lot of maybe even content maybe even mechanics maybe even upgraded mechanics maybe even new units and stuff like that but Apparently they are not going to release them because they have no idea how to do it. The game is still on negative on Steam on 58% and so on. So okay, what it, uh, that's kind of like what I read on the forums. Don't count me on that because I'm not sure if it's true or not. First of all, they allow you to interact with stuff on your horse. But I'm still using the speed mode, so I have no idea how fast you move on your horse or uh, alone. Oh, it seems like the the speed mode has gotten even speedier. Oh, that's actually too much thunder. Now, this didn't fix the problem with the FPS or other problems, but let's see if we can actually recruit stuff from the... Yeah. You don't have to get your high horse now. Another thing they changed that was very very important for the game is to have the FOV slider which was huge, why didn't they add this in the beginning? FOV 90, also makes frame rate is set to 60 right now, by the way when you actually start the game the V-Sync will be enabled so don't forget to disable it. And yeah you can look at the settings a little more but that's more or less the major changes, I'll link all of the patch notes in the comment section, actually I'll just copy them. Another very important thing is we have autosave right now. Let's see how fast it is. One, two, three. It's slow. <laughs> I mean, it's quick save and quick load, but it's actually more like save game and load game. It's not a quick, it's nothing quick about it. But it allows us a little more freedom. They also fixed some quests in the beginning. They also fixed that major exploit where you could recruit troops for free in your reserve. They also modified the starting gear for characters if you choose to restart your game and a few fixes here and there and that's kind of it. Arabian strategy. Have you heard anything about someone named Xandor? Oh, of course I know Xander. He's the most irresponsible royal mage to ever live. Hard to forget a man like that. A scoundrel took three of my books to check for references, and I've neither seen nor heard from him since. It's been more than a week. He's scampering all over the country with my priceless tomes in tow. I keep tracking his movements, but he always manages to slip away. Do you know where to find Xandor? Not Xander precisely, but the books. Have you not heard of library markings? Ta, ah, never mind. You'll see everything in a moment. Eke Liberos. Can you feel them now? Almost. Okay, so I have another quest. So yeah, that's kind of like the update <laughs> status for the game. And that's why I don't really think we'll receive much in terms of updates. We'll probably receive a DLC in a month or two. And sadly I think the game will just get abandoned because well there's nothing they can do with it. The game is so bad that 
Like I said, even the broad audience don't want to mess around with it, and all of the streamers and all of the YouTubers gave up on it already. So at this point, they're kind of in a pickle. Are you a magister? They have to release more content for the game and more fixes, but at the same time the investors and the studio want to make more money, and that is not possible. I mean, in this stage of the gameplay, it's very hard to do something else with the game except try to fix it and recuperate what has been lost. But then again, when it's... They can prepare the game for a sale, so they can sell the game at half price and the reviews will definitely go up a lot more. If this game was 25 euros, I guess the game would be somewhere at 70% on Steam, but now I think it will drop a little bit because of some of the changes they will implement. But we'll just have to see. That's only my intuition. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. Sorry, I got distracted. Are you watching this guy? Yes. I monitor the glow and color of the stars, for such is my discipline. I can see you've come from afar. The road that lies ahead of you is also long. You're right. My journey is not yet over. But what made you say that? I have a map to a dungeon. It is full of magic artifacts and ancient treasures. I had once thought of going there myself. But I see now that this will never happen. May I buy your map? Of course. It's yours for a mere handful of gold coins. The old man looks honest. But this may be a risky venture. Oh, it's you. I heard about the epic battle in the Marcellan dungeons. Shame I wasn't there. I'm sure you would have shone in battle, sir. But you're in luck. You can help me arrest the traitor and murderer Baron Dupont. In return, I'll help you with the tabula of... of Tyne Sad... Duckling. The tabula can wait. I have a different task for you. Help us find some fresh recruits for the guard. To restore Nostria's rightful position in the world, Montier sent most of our knights abroad on crusade. There are barely enough fighting men left to guard the citadel. In a tavern not far from here, you'll find Greflet, a former brother-in-arms. He's a mercenary now. He commands a troop called the Grey Knights. Rumor has it, He's drinking pure aquas by the barrel, brawling and frightening the maids and disciples. Now, here's what I'm thinking. You have a supple way with words. Perhaps you could speak with Greflet and see how he and his grey knights are set for work. Ideally, you'll persuade them to leave their mercenary lives behind and enlist in the Royal Guard. They're strong and capable warriors. If you're able to enlist Greflet, many folks will be indebted to you, and not just the Guard. Hmm. Okay, I guess we just have more and more and more and more quests. Uh, buy a treasure map. How do you buy a treasure map? I thought I bought one. How wonderful! You're rich. Thank you. I love being rich. Dungeon. How exciting! That map is more than just a dusty old bit of vellum with an X on it. It is a dream. May it come true in your hands. Oh, only 500 gold. Well, that's not actually a lot of gold. Okay, let's just look at the quest again. So, oh, this is a main quest. <laughs> I am getting a lot more quests. So, fake report. Yeah, I'll have to report that guy. But to be honest, it looks, like, it looks like power is the best thing to choose. Power and order, of course, but you're, you're going to get sidetracked with a lot of other stuff as well. I'm not sure that if they fix the bug where if you sell everything... Ah, if you sell uh, all items at the same time, you lose the du duplicate gold. The gold from the duplicated item, the gold that have, the gold from the items that have more than one. 
Kopi. Zakhar. What do you think of this marvel? The first prototype guardian golem. First and until a certain component is found, also the last one. But who is that behind him in the pavilion? I've seen him before. Didn't you recognize the man? That's his serenity, Archmage Kaythorn. How fortunate to find him here. I am on a mission from Prince Adrian to discuss the Mompatri disaster. Oh, that's out of the question right now. First, the Archmage is deep in meditation. He dislikes being interrupted. Second, the Archmage is in low spirits. As his disciple, I assure you, tis better to wake a dragon than face him in such a state. Uh, let's wake up the dragon then. What will I get for uh, doing that for anarchy? I guess we need an auto heal by for them, but I I want that extra leadership. Also more HP, more uh, rewards for winning battles. But at the same time, do I really need the last two, which are? Phantasmal Guardian. What? Someone can... Hmm, that's interesting as well. Yeah, the Anarchy one doesn't seem so good. It's better if you use Anarchy troops, I'm sure, but since I'm not using them, it's not so interesting. The power ones, on the other hand, are super good. Yeah, let's go and do that, because sorry about... Wait, did you actually look at the Guardian Golem? Man, nothing special. Maybe when he's rank 3, he'll be more special. Erasmus? Eh, yeah, probably. I don't know where I'm going, that's why I cannot go around. Hmm, this table has strange lights. I can't speak right now. I can barely move, see? There's so much to do. I found Yvonne in the woods, bound in place by a spell. Ah, Yvonne. It's totally harmless. She won't even age while she's frozen there. Her beauty awaits me. What do you mean? Or perhaps I don't really want to know. I don't really I want frightened. to know. I worried that she'd leave me if she was free to. Your fears do not concern me. Tell me how to lift the curse. Just stand before her and speak the word care aloud. She'll become animate again at once. Listen, life has been hard on me of late. Perhaps I shouldn't have done it, but I feel as though I'm barely alive right now. We were casting the spell for several days straight, pouring mana all over the quarantine dome over Monpatri. Please, I want to apologize. Bring this unwilting bouquet to Yvonne. I enchanted it for her. Will you do this for me? Well, it doesn't say if it's a... Uh, yeah, whatever, let's just take the bouquet. Despite my vast knowledge and rich stock of Logoi, I cannot express my gratitude. Here's the Logoi you might want to try. I'm sorry, I was wrong. I'll visit her once I feel a bit better.
Yeah, I'm mostly eating right now because mm, I think I'm out of things to comment on because the game is kind of linear as it is. So I guess you have to go. Oh man, we really need a teleport over here. What does that mean, dear heart? And I also need a lot more money so I can recruit those level three mages or those. Yeah, level 3. Or tier 3 mages. Hmm. The game is a lot more stable, it seems. Hmm. <laughs> Unless I do a quick turn. Yeah. It also doesn't provoke motion sickness as much because your FOV is 90. It's not no. It was on 75 before. And she didn't age a single second more. You know she's aging every second. Uh, oh, that sounds so bad. How are you feeling? What happened? Karantzis the mage put a spell on you. The spell has been lifted. Oh, by the gods, my head is spinning like a top. Oh. What Karantzis did to you was awful, but he wants to apologize. He sent these lovely flowers. What? Flowers? He understands. Why would I want his apologies? He treats me as his property. Like I'm an amusing plaything. He casts a spell on me and violates my person. Then all he does is apologize. Well, I didn't catch what I got, but I assume it was money, and I like money. And I need a lot of money, so how are we on the quest situation? We have to go, we have to go back into the mage tower, solve those quests as well, and then maybe add some new troops, and then go and destroy the whatever I'm supposed to destroy over here. Okay, you are back. Another thing I don't understand is how are the golems not happy? I guess that medal is nice, but again, it's not really offering me any straight benefits because I'm not getting anything from the morale bonus because it really triggers. I might as well change it to something else. Hmm, doesn't seem like I have anything else. Hmm, I cannot wait until I get a lot more money so I can buy every artifact in the game like I used to do in other games. So I can see if they actually mean something, or they're just, you know, random artifacts. Or if they actually have some synergy with troops or themselves. Okay, these guys are moving, that's great. Divine that you'd accept. Oh, I'm floating on the ground again. Cards also divined my name. It's Enya, right? Wow. See? A mistake. A mistake with Cedric. Mistakes are unacceptable. Unprofessional. We lured the mage out with a guide. But we never caught Is him. Is he talking to himself? That's the first time of being crazy. Here you are. Do not be frightened. Come closer. The master has ordered that you not be touched, as long as you remain useful. Indeed. Attempt to touch me, and you will regret it. Your hands are soaked in blood. 
We can sense it. Sometimes blood needs to be spilled for the sake of justice. What do you want? Naturally. We need to borrow something from the spellcaster's sorceress books. But we cannot enter the mage's tower. The mages are careful to prevent the adepts from entering. We might alter our appearance through magic, but the gates are all protected by the spell of disillusion. We coaxed an ignorant fool from the tower into bringing us notes on this spell. But a group of bandits stabbed him to death before we could procure them. Find the body at the fair. Learn the spell of disillusion's weaknesses. Sneak into the tower and disrupt the spell. Bring us proof of your success and we will aid you against DuPont. I've never disrupted spells of this nature before. How do I go about it? The mage had the notes on his person when he was killed. Read them. Find the weakness. Indeed I will. Of course I will. I love reading and walking around. My boy wrote to say oh, that's... Started studying the art of that's nice sound from that bird. Oh, this is a perfect yard. I wish I could live in a place like this. Just look at how nice this is. You have the fence actually surrounding this. You have this kind of like a little gate thing over here with a little room on top of it to kind of watch the entrances. You have various stores over here. And that's the house itself over here. And also you have kind of like this huge bathtub. I like this place. I wish I could live in a place like this. It's so magical. You must be a regular here. Do you know Fontaine of Rickville? Uh, yeah. He rushed in here just a little while ago. Scared stupid. He's hiding in the backyard, terrified someone's gonna come for him. He's a jittery fella. I guess we searched the barrels. <laughs> Oh, I have to press E to take all. They might have changed some of the other stuff as well. Knock, Fontaine, knock, knock. Are you there? Please come out. I need to talk to you. Yeah, right. So you can beat me too? Yes. Your master Kamas asked me to find you. He's oh so worried. Or is he worried about his tools? I didn't quite understand. I know. That's why I'm hiding. Well, if you won't come willingly. Then I'll have to call the stone skin troll <laughs> and he'll smash that battle. I much prefer looking at your face instead of that barrel. Why That's not a face. I'm trying to stay away from Kamos. I got beaten once already today. I don't need a licking from him too. Someone beat you up? Who? And why? These bandits at the fair. I left the carriage behind too. If I were you, I'd go to Rickful and calmly relate these events to Kamos. But you don't know Kamos. He won't listen. I abandoned his carriage and tools. Well, that's all it'll take for him to judge me guilty. So bandits are roaming around the fair. How did they end up there? No idea. I ran for it once the brawl started up. People were being beaten, stalls, trashed, things stolen. I just ran. I'm not ashamed. My life is worth more than a box of tools. I'm not sure about that. Depends on what you are talking about. These are mages. They don't care about people. Ancient treasure, DuPont estate. Where is that fair? The fair probably is over here. Hmm. That's another castle apparently over there. We're actually making a lot of progress because we're sticking to the main quest, which actually has a lot of other quests for us. Please don't be copyrighted. Like the other one. The goal is become a little better, but it's still laughable how how little gold you actually receive from exploration. How 
spells and acquiring more and more mana. The spells are getting harder to cast. Let us raise a glass of aquas to love. What is Aquis section? Let's uh, have a look at it. It doesn't say much about it. Probably it's just a wine. Sorry. Oh, you're not from the fair, are you? Why are you crying? What happened? Oh, I'm sorry. Do you know about the fair on the eastern road? Uh, merchants from Lorien and Artisania gather there to, to trade. No, I haven't been there in a long time. Why do you ask? My father Edel went to the fair and never returned. He promised to return within a day with a present for me, but he's still not back. Perhaps you'll learn something if you're out that way. Oh my. I think you are sent to the farms. Or to the farm. I did what you asked of me. Now it's up to you to interpret the readings. Can you do it? <laughs> no, of, of course not. But fortunately, the Creator has heard my prayers. Amanda, a, a neighbor of mine from Parna, found me. Let me present her to you and she'll explain it all. Amanda? Pleased to meet you. Let me introduce myself. I'm Amanda, a disciple of the Mage's Tower. Bernard was exceedingly nervous about the device, so I said I would try to figure it out myself. Let me see it. Give me a few minutes. Oh yeah, this is about the plague. Okay, that was enough. How's our device doing? Any clue what it does? It indicates a strong efflux of dark charms in the village. Most intensely by the mountain wall. What could it be? Oh, creator! The mage's tower! Mage's tower what? It is responsible grills. for that. There are several of these round waste grills on high and one of them is open. That means the mages were dumping their magical garbage down on the village. The locals have nothing to do with it. We thought the villagers of Rickville were poisoning us. They've always hated us. But as it turns out, the mages are truly to blame. My heart is with you. But my mind requires proof. How about this? Let's meet in the Mage's Tower in the yard by the Market Street. I seem to recall something relevant in the archives. Not to worry, I'll figure something out. A village of tragedy. And they have new shoes. Where are they? Oh, it's over here. Okay, so we're actually doing a lot of progress. So this is one of the quests that people didn't know how to continue. So I shielded the miller's daughter with my left hand and picked up an iron bar with the other and battered that man. Out. What? Whoa there. Look at that mad wizard go. Yeah, you know. What did he want? Screaming around like an arrow shot horse? Today is a beautiful day. Could you tell me what you meant by Mad Wizard? Mad yeah, he's wizard. our guy. He's really our guy. Yeah, I can't tell you much. That odd bird didn't say a lot that made sense. It burst in here, eyes all crazed and gleaming. As if someone was chasing him with a broadsword. I tried to calm him. I spoke very soothingly. Then he screamed, Don't touch me! Palatinus's name is cursed! And fled, never to be seen again. Do you happen to know where he fled? To the old ruins. They're not far from here. Who was that mad wizard? Could it be Palatinus? Is it the same guy that was hiding in the barrel? It looks like the same character. I mean, the same character model. So I shielded the village daughter with my left hand and picked up an iron bar with the other. Who are you? Another one of those who want to get to the Dupont's estate? So you should know. I only guard it. I have no invitations. So you're the commander of those very knights serving Dupont? Ha! <laughs> That's right. I wouldn't have touched him with a ten-foot pole. 
There was one girl, poetess, but he took her from me, bastard. If you don't like it so, maybe you should return to the Royal Guard. They're calling up all former knights. Let them call up as much as they wish. I'm not going to return. I don't want to be blamed in Mama Rock's death again. Never, ever. I'm tired of that story. I'm afraid I have no idea what you're talking about. Here's something. All right. I had a brother in arms, Baron Lamarock. He had a castle right here under the hill. I visited it quite often. So, one day we had a fight in front of the guests. A serious fight. And some bastard took advantage of that. That very night he was killed. Stabbed in the back with a dagger. In his own bedroom. I was accused of his murder and kicked out of the guard. That's it. Not a word more. And Castle Lamarock burned down soon after. Not by accident, obviously. Someone covering their tracks. But my heart tells me that some clues may have been left there. Wish I could find those bastards. Well, I need to examine Scooby the ruins of Castle Lamarock. Where are you? I, we have a mystery. Okay, we need to search the ruins of that castle. Oh, man. We're really the detective in this game. Nothing more, nothing less. Well, I guess you have time to search the... No, we have to find the mage. Let's finish the mage quest. Or the one with Amanda. <laughs> and maybe next episode we'll have some real combat. Yeah, sometimes you just get bogged down by so much dialogue. Oh, there she was. She was not even materialized. The fears have been confirmed. A short while before the epidemic began, an artifact was brought to the tower. It was excavated from somewhere deep in the ancient crypts on Mage Actarius's orders. Apparently, the mage in, in question is our librarian. He's incredibly nasty, but he seems to reserve an especially black hatred for me. He refuses even to speak to me. How odd. I never thought mages could be so wicked and petty. Since you're here, could you talk to him, please? Meanwhile, I'll try to find out something about artifacts and curses. Yeah, just borrow a book, never give it back. That seems to be the general way to solve things around here. Borrow a book. I guess I needed some side quest to finish before I get more money. Perhaps the culprit came in through the window instead of picking the lock and made off with his ill-gotten loot that way. That's just the point. It's impossible. The windows were latched from inside. The thief must have used magic then. I can't help you with that. Yeah, and who can? Those cups cost a fortune. The tower spirits can. They only obey magisters. You'll want an appointment with Meister. Please, no more quests, just let me solve my own quest first. Thievery? Huh, nonsense. It was a magic experiment. Any mage worth his wand could see that. Why so anxious? Are you behind the disappearance of the silver cups? You could say that, but the reality is much more complicated. I don't think an outsider like you can appreciate the essence of my research. I'll try and explain the basics. Surely you're familiar with Kathon's treaties on the nature of things? I'd be surprised if you weren't. My experiment was intended to discover whether one's logoi can affect the concept of a silver cup. And it succeeded. I don't claim to understand any of that, but I'm pretty sure you'll be arrested for theft. Um, I admit I do feel a little bit guilty for depriving someone of their valuable possessions. Awkward indeed. It shouldn't be difficult to reverse the spell and have the cups rematerialize from the concept. All I need is the right ingredients. Do you happen to have some manor infused water, a silver bracelet, and a crystal orb on you? I could go gather them myself, but I'm a little wary of venturing out right now. No, I don't have anything of the kind. I'm sure I can find them, though. Yeah, we need the uh, items that we can find. I mean, we need the quest items, not the items I have on myself. Mr. Actarius, 
Could you tell me something about the artifact the mages uncovered in the ancient crypts? What, again? I'm tired of explaining myself. I haven't followed that kind of research in countless years. I'm a librarian for Ulagi's sake. Ah, that crazy Amanda woman sent you, right? She's always nosing around where she's not welcome. What does being rude accomplish? Even Prince Adrian shows better manners around me. Oh, so you know the prince personally. What was it you wanted? It's just that... Where is the artifact now? Might you know who made use of it? And how? I don't know where the artifact is now. This was a long time ago. There might be more about it in the research log. You can find it in the alchemy lab. Thank you so much. You've been a great help. Yes, but that doesn't solve the problem. It only makes us go somewhere else. Okay, let's try to solve some of these quests at least, because they're just walking. Walking sims. Exceeding expectations, so what is this all about? Frigid seal. Well, before I enlist them, I think I have to do that other quest. Oh, that's it. No, I demand of you capture that darn spirit. Castle Arden is my ancestral home. It's not in the best. I only press space to pick it up. What happened? Do I have to fight something? It said magical orb. Not, <laughs> not possess magical orb. Yeah, this is so, so, I mean, this is a copy of the first arena you fight in. I think they repeated this in the spirit fight, in the ghost fight over there. Slightly weaker enemy. I guess it's another uh, spirit fight. Your spirits will be burned. Chickens. Chickens. Oh, chickens, griffins, another chickens and light elementals. They went straight for the crossbowmen, of course. Blade. Oh yeah, they finally fixed that problem. Okay, so now spells no longer center the camera on your hero. That's so nice. They fixed that uh, that one as well. You know, just attack them in melee. <laughs> Hit them with your crossbow bolt. Looks like they don't have animations for melee attacks. It's 
actually quite good. No, that was a mistake. I should have just... No, that was another mistake. I do think I can heal him because it's a golem. Do we care? No, we don't care. Even if it's a golem, we can heal it. Yeah, that was a mistake. Because I forgot about the griffins. Is it my turn? Oh yeah, it's my turn. Yeah, they still didn't modify it. I guess you get a little peep on the flag that is... That is under con your control right now, but they should have just made that a lot bigger. Just buffing one or buffing among them among themselves, nothing too bad over there. Oh, it's your last night. Uh, let's not take any chances, so let's just heal him straight away. Yeah, let's just free up those other guys. Now we're actually starting to deal the real damage. Uh, I think that will do friendly fire, so let's not do that. And another magic missile missile goes to hurt the spirit. I hope that's enough to finish the fight. Man, some fights are so long. A slightly weaker, but again, not really... Not really devoid of all defenses and attacks. It was quite dangerous. 1,500 gold wasted. That's not so good. I guess we got the Astral Warp back. Come on, give me back to the real world so I can plan my revenge. I implore you. No. But do we really have the magic orb in our possession? <laughs> no, I don't really see it. Report. Well, I have to tell him the truth. I know you. I recognize you from the Universal Assembly. 
Anyone would remember your face. You're very kind, milady. I'm sorry I must ask, but who are you? I am Baroness Gazella Wilmore Durden. What luck running into you. It's a pleasure to meet you, Baroness. What makes you so glad to see me? I wanted to visit my ancestral home, Castle Arden, relive childhood memories, maybe even repair the structure. But an enraged rogue spirit has taken root there. And while these mages are refusing to help me, the creature is wrecking my family's castle. My lady, your words wound me. My disciples are doing their utmost to help you, even as we speak. But Archmage Caithorn claims you'd need an army to capture this, as he calls it, Air Elemental. According to the Archmage, the Elemental escaped from the Mage Factory. Since he also claims the Mage Factory is suffering the plague, I and everyone else in Nostria would appreciate it if you assisted these students of the much-esteemed Sequester in capturing that darned spirit. The Mage Factory. I'd like to meet the spirit. So do I, so do I. I always just show the quill because I'm tired of doing all of those quests. How may I be of assistance? Have students ever falsified someone else's grade? As a prank? Uh, could you be more specific? <laughs> yes, that's it. You won't yes. harm him, will you? Rosens gave me a magic quill. He asked that I use it to tamper with the alchemy grades. Outrageous. These are future alchemists. The purity of their minds has a direct influence on the mixtures. I cannot let this pass without consequences. Give me the quill. Me. Yeah. We've no mm, why can Order points acquired. A scroll is directly behind me. Where are oh, okay. we? We cannot leave that alone. We have to take it. Okay, now let's solve the rest of the problem. I implore you. No, I demand of you. I mean, we just enter the laboratory, take it, and we are good. Be magical waste, brown root, a sense of will, a class class be magical waste, blue man effect, uh, standard, the duty sex. What the charge the artifact? Ancient creep source unknown and it's a magical way. A class A magical waste. Artifact is toxic and dangerous. Wow, this is this is okay. One of the longer quests. I don't know why they have to make them so long. Hey, you're coming with me. It seems like some of the sometimes the length of the quest is directly proportional to how hard the game will become, and the game will become much harder than now. But again, it will still be easy mode. So, eh. Maybe, but you're not moving, so I can go around. Okay, we got that other scroll as well. Now we have basically all of the scrolls in the city. Or in the mage tower. Wow, okay, okay. Let's do some quests. Please let me finish this quest as well. <laughs> I need it. It will be a, a moral victory. I need a moral victory for myself. Otherwise, I'll not be able to finish the game. Actually, I need to start a new game today. It depends on what it will be. I'm not sure yet. Oh, yeah. He, the rebel assistant was actually over here, near the grates. No. Oh, I almost it missed you, him. Isn't it? It's dangerous up here. Did you know that? Well, uh, what, what do you mean? You don't know? The waste left over from the examination of the ancient artifact 
you dumped it out here. On the village below, no less. How did you find out? Did that spirit send you? I don't know what spirit you're talking about, but you poisoned an entire village. It's not my fault! I was following the spirit's orders. Look, that artifact is possessed by a spirit. A ghost. Some restless soul. It's been haunting my dreams. Then it demanded I ignore the rules and dump the waste right over there. Don't lie to me. Why would a spirit give you instructions like that? The water was imbued with a magic that empowers the spirit. Once that water ended up in Parnak, they all got sick. Now he wants to know where the artifact is buried, but well, no one's gonna tell me that. I'm a mere disciple. An exhausted disciple. Now I see. You should have reported everything to the Elder Mages from the start, instead of giving in to the evil spirit's wishes. You alone are responsible for your misery, Sax. That didn't help at all, now what? Bernard at the tavern, what tavern? Now those quests sound like something super important. Okay, let's actually turn to the tavern and then we'll... Uh, I mean, we'll end the video. That was an interesting session, the reading session, but I guess the, yeah, the pacing of the game is all wrong sometimes. And the teleporter, the fast travel things, are not really close to where you need them. I guess they couldn't have made too many of them, but still it feels a little weird. And in the next episode we'll probably do a lot more quests, because we're just starting some quests here and there, we're solving the main part of the quest, but not really ending them. But why? My boy wrote to say he started studying. Oh, is the other building? Oh, I'm so glad to see you. Did you find anything out at the mage's tower? Yes, Bernard. I found out that a restless spirit forced a young mage to rain enchanted water down onto your village. The water was infused with dark magic. That is what poisoned the villagers. But why did this ghost want to harm our village? What did we ever do to him? I'm not sure I know. The spirit was awakened from a long slumber granted by an ancient artifact. It was an unfortunate oversight. What now? Will this entity feed on our strength until we all wither away to empty husks? The energy drained from the villagers is captured within that artifact. I have no idea where it is, though. The mage is buried it somewhere. Oh, why did I get tangled up in all this? There's no hope left for us. If someone could find that wretched spirit and bring it to justice, the entire village is dying. Someone like a paladin? How is that possible? We, you work for the prince, don't you? Oh, he no, figured it out. Amanda said the artifact had been dug up from those crypts on the other side of the bridge. Okay, that was actually a decent experience, decent stuff, I, I did get some money and some experience out of all of these adventures. Well, that wasn't too hard to figure out. <laughs> Mad scientist? 
I found you. Oh yeah, he's Palatinus. You must be the mage Palatinus. The shield makes talking very awkward. Please raise it. I mean, we do have an army behind us. Torturing me. My soul is a fire. Can you not see how I am suffering? Oh, never again will I pursue easy money. The elementals are charging my shield right now. If you dare break into their cage, they'll tear you to pieces. Neither you nor they can get me. Now get out of here. Venenum, magnum, letum, veritas, fishta. Venenum, magical, fishta. Why can't I remember? Curse this poison. Leave me be. Let me. Yeah, it looks like we have to fight a lot of creatures. What about the loot? That's everything that's over here in the ruins? No. I refuse to believe that we don't have loot over here. Where is that weird light coming from? I mean, it's... I guess the developers made a mistake or something. Yeah, nothing in here except for the obelisk, which will give us one magic power. That's nice. <laughs> this is kind of like the backyard for the place. I mean, I see something over there, but... Oh, I couldn't reach it. Oh, you can go down here as well. So, looking at the DuPont estate, idea, yeah, I don't want to attack the guards. I just want the guards to join... Oh, my beloved prince. To join the royal guard. Those are some weird lights. Okay, before I end the video, I just want to see what will be facing on in the magic sphere Ooh. in the match. That's a sign of true genius and madness. Solve the rune or destroy the spirits from Palatine's cage. Hmm. I guess I want more power points than more rather than finesse points. Finesse. I guess we can touch the runes and we basically solve some of them. I guess I'll have to do this both ways. One will be solving the puzzle and the other one will be the battle but I'll do that in the next video and I'll reload the game after a slightly weaker enemies I mean they are not really a match for me iron golems are pretty weak at this point ice elementals are great but I guess they are a little weak as well oh they are ranked too and a bunch of wind spirits Now I guess this will be the perfect time to end the video because in the next episode I can fight them and I can also solve the little puzzle. I think I saw two of the rooms where they were. In case someone wants to go for the finesse as well. Oh, that's another room, so I can see already two rooms over here. Yeah, this is actually a pretty nice puzzle. Hey, textures, come back. I, I'm sorry I misbehaved. Yeah, this is a job for the next episode. Bye.